Hi and welcome to Fit by Liz. My name is Alyssa and I am a certified personal trainer. Today I'm going to be taking you through a cool down and stretching routine for at home workouts. So let's go right ahead and get into it. We're going to start in the center of our mats. Take three big breaths in through your nose and out through your mouth. One more and let it out. Perfect. Now it helps to have a wall handy um, or something you can hold on to if your balance isn't the greatest. Otherwise, you're going to reach back. You're going to grab the top of your left foot. Mind your posture here. Keep taking those full breaths. And it helps to focus on pointing your knee down to the mat below you just to get a little bit deeper of a stretch. And with that same leg up, just at your chest. And with that left leg, once again, you're gonna step it a couple of feet back behind your right foot and press that heel down. Leaning forward to feel that extension through the back of your leg, those hamstrings and those calf muscles. Breathe into that stretch. And step it forward, we're gonna do the same thing with that other leg. So let me turn around, grab the top of your right foot. Keep breathing that oxygen into those muscles. And you're gonna bring that knee in front. Hold it for a moment. And step that right foot back a couple of feet behind your left foot. Lean it forward, bringing that right heel down to the mat, feeling that extension through the back of the leg. Step it back to the end of your mat. Lift both arms up, inhale, and exhale, fold it down. Pulsing those hands through those legs. And just let those arms hang from here. Maybe stir the pot, do some elephant trunks, whatever feels good to your body. Maybe nod your head yes, shake your head no. Now this cool down works whether you did a HIIT workout, right? You did cardio, strength training, Pilates, bar, whatever you did. This cool down will be good for you. And if you want to make this longer, you can always just slow this video down or hold any stretches a little bit longer. Walk those hands out just halfway and you're gonna bring those knees down, come into a tabletop. We're gonna cycle through cat and cow. So inhale, look up to the sky, drop your belly button down, and exhale, curve your spine, tuck your chin, tuck your pelvis. Keep going here at your own pace with your breath. Fully filling up those lungs, and fully letting all of that air out. Perfect, with that right arm, you're gonna lift it up, opening up that chest, following it with your eyes. And bring it down, other side, use that left arm, lift it up, follow it with those eyes. And bring it down. Walk those hands out a little bit farther, widen those knees, bring those heels together, and bring your sit bones back into that child's pose. Walk those hands over to the right side, put your left hand over your right. 
press a little deeper into that stretch. And over to that left side, bring that right hand over the left. Once again, if it feels good to stay in child's pose a little bit longer, you can always hold any of these stretches as long as you want. Back to the center. Just give me a few more deep breaths here. Walk those hands back slowly. Roll your way up to a seated position. Thanks for joining me. I hope you're feeling nice and refreshed. If you did enjoy stretching it out with me, make sure to like this video and also leave a comment. As always, please subscribe to my channel. You can ring the notification bell as well if you want to be notified every time I post. I post new workouts Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays at 10 a.m. And I will see you in the next one.